Gems. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm recording this video for you guys. And this video is my top seven, mm -hmm, top seven favorite lipsticks. <laughs> so I recorded this video three times already. So I am like bonkers right now with this video but i want to go ahead and get this out to you guys because i'm super excited and i know I'll, these are some great shades um and i would love for you guys to pick some of these shades up tell me how you like them and whatnot so let's go ahead and get into this video and let me show you my top seven faves okay so my first fave is the one that i have on right now and i love this lipstick and it's funny enough odd enough that i absolutely love this collection from the drugstore and the reason why i'm showing you my top seven drugstore faves is because i know a lot of you guys are on a budget and i know that some of you guys you know can't really afford a lot of high-end lipsticks and whatnot and you know i'm definitely a budget girl so you know, I just know that a lot of you guys are budget. So let's jump right into it, like I said. The first lipstick I have on is the Maybelline lipstick, and this one is Fuchsia Flash, okay? And I'm not normally a fan of the Maybelline lipsticks because to me, they smell like Play-Doh. Me and my best friend Ellie both think they smell like Play-Doh. Um, but these ones don't have such a strong scent as the other ones. So again, this one is number 865 Fuchsia Flash. It's the one I have on right now. And this happens to be one of my favorite lip combos, which is um, MAC Night Moth along with this lipstick just gives me life, honey. It's just straight instantaneous life. Ain't nothing nobody can tell me nothing right now okay i just know i'm cured okay so let me give you guys a swatch of this lipstick right here and there's the swatch of it right here it's just a really gorgeous hot pink color very neon so that's number one number two and we're gonna jump right into it is number 875 miss vivid rose okay i absolutely love this lipstick if you're a person who does not like red lips or are not you know are not used to red lips or you're trying to get into red lips i would say try vivid rose it's like a rosy red kind of pinkish color it'll give you the pop of red you need but it has an undertone of pink which is why i really love this lipstick because absolutely freaking gorgeous like this is just a gorgeous lipstick i'm gonna go ahead and stop talking about it and just swatch it for you guys and this is a swatch of vivid rose these two shades are definitely definitely perfect for the summertime but even though i'm a girl who wears my lipsticks whenever but these are definitely perfect for the spring and summer where it's not spring anymore but summertime you definitely want to get these in and vivid rose you definitely would love to have this around fall and the holiday season okay so the next two colors that i have to show you guys are two nudes and this nude is the revlon lip butter and this one is called pink truffle and i think i was in my best friend ellie when i picked this up i'm not sure if she purchased it for me or what but i know we were together when i got it but anyway i've used it so much like that's all that i have left like that's it um i'm not a big fan of nude lips but i think i have maybe like three in my collection that i just absolutely would die for and this happens to be one of them and i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys this one and it's just a gorgeous kind of like brownie mauvey kind of it has a pink kind of undertone to it and i really really like it it looks really gorgeous on the lips and um if you guys hear the big bang in the back it is also fourth of july that i'm recording this video so if you guys are having a good time drink up turn up okay happy fourth of july to you guys but by the time you guys see this video it would be after fourth of july but i hope you guys are being safe and i love you okay jim so my next nude lipstick is the nyx soft matte lip cream and this one is actually in the color london now this one is not like how the revlon lip butter is this one's more like a nude it kind of blinks out your lips but it's absolutely gorgeous i do like to wear it with like a dark brown lip liner or sometimes i like to pair it with like current or night moth from mac and and it's absolutely gorgeous on the lips but if you want to throw it on and go you definitely can all these shades are throw it on and go shades you don't have to do anything and they're all women of color friendly so if you're my shade a little bit darker a little bit lighter all these shades you can definitely work with and as you can see it's just a nice creamy nude and it dries on your lips matte but it's not like that crispy hard matte you know um, that kind of like dries your lips out it's not like that at all it just is a really nice matte and it just kind of dries and adheres like to your lips basically and that is why I really really like it okay 
So the next color that I want to show you guys is 911D, which is Spotlight Red. And I got this from um, Walgreens. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's from Wet n Wild. And for $1.99, you cannot beat it. I feel like every girl who owns lipstick, who is into makeup, whether you are dark skin, light skin, in between, whatever skin tone you are, you need a great red. And this is a great affordable red. And this one, like I said, um... When you put it on, it just kind of makes your teeth appear whiter, like so much brighter and whiter, and I absolutely love that. Any lipstick that can do that is awesome, so I definitely love this lipstick. And again, this is not a drying, it's a matte lipstick, but it's not a drying matte at all. It does have like a semi, it's like a semi matte finish because you can see a little bit of gloss to it. But that is Spotlight Red, and it is absolutely a gorgeous color, one of my favorite, favorite drugstores brands besides the Maybelline one is definitely wet and wild because they have great affordable lipsticks now the next two are some staple favorites and one this one I'm about to show you I really don't know if you guys can purchase it or can get it I'm not sure if it was limited edition was it limited to us who reviewed the products from Milani because it does come from Milani and it is their new formulation you know the new packaging lipsticks I did a review for them if you guys have been rocking with my channel for a while I do have all those lipstick um, videos posted as well as swatches of different colors on me so if you guys want to check those out definitely do but this one right here is number 33 Rose Amour I cannot find this anywhere in the drugstore I wanted to pick up a back one backup one this lipstick is in a class of its own I've never really had like a Barbie pink lipstick and this is more of like that Barbie pink it's like that light pink it's not really like Saint Germain but it's just in a class of its own and I do not know why this is not in the stores there's every color there but number 33 so I've been searching for it in Walgreens Walmart and every time I go and look in the lipstick area I never see this lipstick can you guys see how gorgeous that is it's like such a gorgeous color it almost reminds me of maybe like a candy yum yum it's not exactly a matte I cannot remember what finish it is maybe more like a cream kind of finish um, but it's definitely not like drying on the lips at all but when you put it on I swear every time I wear this lipstick and fuchsia flash people always ask me girl what lipstick you got on and I'll be like mm, honey they be like is it mad mm -mm. drugstore boo boo so freaking gorgeous I absolutely love this color oh can't say enough about it okay so the next color is from CoverGirl. I feel like the CoverGirl Lip Perfection lipsticks don't get enough love. I feel like people um, kind of loved them when they first came out and then they kind of forgot about them because new stuff came out. But these lipsticks are absolutely awesome. The reason why I love this one, this is number 330 and this color is called Divine, okay? And I absolutely love this color. A lot of people think it's a dupe to heroin. Since I don't own heroin, I can't really tell you guys if it's a dupe to Max Heroin or not. But I can tell you that this is definitely a dupe to the OCC Lip Tart in Hoochie. I own both of these and I love both of these. I own Hoochie and I'm pretty sure like once I run out of this that I will continue to just use my Hoochie because you know OCC Lip Tarts last forever. But if I happen to run out of my OCC Lip Tart I definitely would just repurchase this because it's definitely a dead on dupe. The only difference is this has more of a like shiny finish to it. Um, it's not really matte like the OCC Lip Tars. So I kind of feel like it's on your preference of what oh, you want. Like I said, this is an absolutely gorgeous color. And here's a swatch of it. It's just a gorgeous purple. And like what you see in the tube is like what you get on your lips. Like it's absolutely gorgeous. And whether you're dark skin, light skin, again, this is like a hot chart lipstick is off the charts for me I absolutely love love this lipstick and as my sign say in the back I don't know if y'all can see it can I get a hell yeah okay can I get a hell yeah for this lipstick okay hell yeah okay <laughs> but I absolutely lo freaking love this lipstick it's an absolute gorgeous color so definitely and I check out Devon okay guys so that has been my top seven lipsticks i hope you guys have enjoyed this video if you have thumbs up for your girl um leave your comments down below and let me know what your top seven drugstore favorite lipsticks are as well as let me know 
um, any lipsticks that I should try out and also let me know if you guys would love to see my top seven Mac faves as well me and Ellie decided that we're probably gonna collab on that video so when you see my video posted up definitely check the bottom bar for her video as well also follow me on Instagram follow me on Keek if you haven't and um yeah I will see you guys later and like I always say it's not about how much it costs it's how you apply it so keep doing your thing and stay beautylicious mm -hmm. see ya